Thanks, Tina. And turning now to baseball, the Yankees won against the Red Sox 10 to 5. And after the game, the Red Sox fired its president. Meanwhile, the Mets played their longest game in history last night, but they lost 10 7 to the Phillies. And we are just a few minutes away now from the top of the 6 o'clock hour. Good Day Wake Up is coming right back on this Monday morning. We take a live look outside, and the sun is just coming up. A beautiful shot right there. Stay with us. WeatherTech is known for providing the ultimate protection for your vehicle. With laser measured floor liners and cargo trunk liner, along with seat protectors and seat back protectors. And now the WeatherTech Cup Phone. With removable cups, fits virtually any size cup holder and adjusts to fit virtually any size phone. Even allows easy access while charging. Whatever you drive, whatever phone you have, Cup Phone is the perfect fit. Order yours today at WeatherTech.com. If something doesn't feel right, it probably isn't. If you ride New Jersey Transit trains or buses or live or work near a station, you know when something doesn't feel right. A person, a bag, or box. If you see something, say something. This is Chief Trisillo of the New Jersey Transit Police. If you see something suspicious, say something by calling us at 1-888-TIPS-NJT or texting NJTVD. Let's make things extra interesting this season. Go on. Imagine doubling your money if either New York team or Philly scores a touchdown in week one. Sounds like a no-brainer. You'd give me those odds? No, but DraftKings would. If either New York team or Philly score a touchdown in week one, you double your money. Plus, everyone gets a deposit bonus up to $500. So download the top-rated sportsbook app and make it rain. From Fox 5 News, this is Good Day Wake Up. Good day, New York. Six o'clock on this Monday morning. Thanks for being with us. I'm Carrie Drew. And I'm Robert Moses. We're so happy you're here on this comfortable late summer morning. Mike Woods is coming up with the forecast for the week ahead. The NYPD is looking for a group of men who attacked a teenager early this morning on the Upper West Side. The victim was stabbed on a subway platform. The leaders of the Air Force have ordered a review of how hotel accommodations are chosen. Questions were raised after several crews were booked at President Trump's resort in Scotland. And the Charging Bull sculpture in Lower Manhattan is expected to be repaired sometime this week. The statue was damaged over the weekend when a man attacked it with a banjo. We have a live report coming up. Just past the 6 a.m. hour again, we're happy you're with us to start your week. And Mike is in with the really beautiful forecast. Yeah, Mike, this September weather is just perfection. Yeah, you got to love it. A lot of folks, they think that, uh, you know, summer's over and it's kind of like at least winding down. But there's still some good stuff out there. And we had that this weekend. We have it this morning. It's kind of fresh outside along the Jersey Shore. 68 degrees there. A little bit of wind. You can see the flag blowing. The sun's not up yet. Not for about another half an hour. But winds are light out of the east-northeast at around 5 